Oh, it's just fabulous to be here at Swetnam Stud at the start of spring. I mean, there's absolutely a spring in everybody's step. And to be in surroundings like this at Swettenham, I couldn't think of anyone, anywhere you'd rather be. The highlight of the day was Americane, just seeing such an amazing animal. And, and up close, it's, it's, it's much more beautiful in the flesh than it is from the grandstand of the races or also on TV. Just seeing him come out and he's just a magnificent animal, unbelievable looking animal. I honestly think that it's one of the best looking horse. His physique's just unbelievable. He's always been a very imposing individual, but he looks in superb condition. Well, I don't think anyone could look at him and, and, and not be impressed. I mean, everyone remembers his great racing victories. So uh, certainly he, he looked very much the part. Beautiful. I think you'd be very proud to be standing American in such a facility, certainly. I mean, of all the horses you could think of at the moment, a bit front of mind that if you could choose, American would have to be the one. It's only the second time I've seen him since he left the racetrack. And We've got a mare booked in to go to him this year, so very interested to have a look at what, how he's let down and how he looks. And I must say, you know, the boys here have done a magnificent job with him. Looks good enough to race. I asked Adam, could we borrow it for November? So um, he said no. But no, it looks, he looks great. And the news of getting 150 odd mares is fantastic. I don't think any of us expected that. And that's what we're wanting to see in, in Victorian breeding. We're trying to see these high quality stallions coming to Victorian studs like Swetnam to boost our breeding industry. We want to be the best state for thoroughbred breeding in Australia and Swetnam certainly leading the way.